What's up guys? I'm here now in San Tropez. This is the main square and that cafe behind me is the iconic place. Cheers guys! I'm drinking shitload of wine in this country, but the wine is fabulous. Look at, look at the, the appetizers you get here. How can you refuse it? Guys, this is it. This is yes. what you gotta come to. I am Kusho. Thank you. Guys, when you're inside Central Bay, look for the fish market. Once you're outside the, the market, you will see this little clam place. This is where Ellie and I had our great oyster experience. So the name of the place This is the place. It's a small place. Grab some oyster, grab a wine. Guys, I was here six years ago. And ever since then, I wanted to come back here and have this experience. So, just want to show you came here for came here for this, came here for that. So whenever you, when you come into San Tropez, you'll find a little fish market behind me. Just walk outside and you'll see the spot here. And just come over here, give it a try. You'll love the oysters here. Cheers. Bad boys. Wow. This isn't good, guys. This is great. Best oysters. For sure.
right now, Christian Dior, this is, I guess, they're on the renovation. Now, this is the iconic landmark. It's too bad they're not open because I wanted to come here for the famous cappuccino. I'm having bruschetta and just wine here. And I got the calamari coming in very soon. But attention to details. guys, Scott here at Bapalong Beach, San Tropez, and obviously this is off season, there's not too many people swimming, but this is a, it's a very nice beach resort. I'm a little bit choked up guys because this is what I've been uh, fantasizing coming back to San Tropez. Now that I'm finally here, it's just too bad that I'm here alone, but Hey guys, I'm here now at Port Grimaud. This is considered to be like the Venice of France. And it's a little tiny cute village. This is how it is. There are many little cafes in the other side of the street. And I'll show you around. Hey guys, today's my last night here in Nice and I got some great suggestions where to go for dinner but between you and me, this is what I'm kind of interested in eating. Freaking McDonald's. I miss a good old fashioned American burger and I also miss Good old fashioned New York dirty water hot dog. Grace papaya, baby. Hey guys, so this is my last night here in Nice. Uh, it's been 10 days here in France right now, and uh, this has been a hell of a journey. I enjoyed every single minute of this country particularly the French Riviera. What can I say? I learned a lot traveling alone. So my takeaway from this trip is I learned, I've learned to take some chances. And um, you know, it's simple stuff like taking the public transportation. Um, who knew, you 
know, I, mean, I had, had no idea what I was. I, I looked at a lot of YouTube videos, how to take the RE, RER trains, the trams. But once you're they're actually there, it's a lot easier than you think. So I really advise you guys, if you're ever traveling alone, please take the risk. Come over here and don't be shy. There will be plenty of people who's going to help you. We would love to live here. This is my culture. This is the way the French people know how to party. This is the way I like to party. They love good food. They love wine. They love to enjoy life. Thank you guys for, for joining me in this venture. France, my next vlog is back to my hometown. New York City, next. So America, I leave you with this.